And it's 8.08. We are Bob and Marianne. In the morning on this beautiful Wednesday, it's October the 21st. And it's hard to believe as we get older, time just flies. It seems to go by faster and faster because it seems like I was just talking to Andy the other day, which I probably was, but on the phone where he's sitting right now. Good morning, Andy Chase. Good morning, Marianne. Good morning, Bob. Thank morning. you for having me this morning. How are you feeling? I'm tired. I'm a little sore. I'm a little achy, but, you know, that, that tells in comparison to what these families, the kids of uh, Ocean County and Ocean of Love go through. So, Okay. Uh, Wait a second. Andy, yeah. hold on. Hold on. Andy, hold on. Hold on. Yes. Where are you? Tell our listener friends where you are and why you are up there and what year is this? Um, this is our 17th year, I believe, for the Ocean of Love Billboard Radio Fun. And we're, I'm living on a billboard. Yes, you are. 30 feet in the air. Uh-huh. And we're in the Target Lowe's Shopping Center on Hooper Avenue. In Tom's River, we're in the northbound, obviously. That's where the Target Lowe's is on northbound Hooper Avenue. And uh, we're here just asking people to stop on by, drop off a donation for Ocean of Love. And Ocean of Love is? It's a charity that helps out families financially, emotionally, whose children have cancer. Uh, you know, a lot of these families go through so, so many tremendous hardships dealing with the treatment of their children, where Ocean of Love will step in and just help out these families, uh, keep a roof over their head, keep the electric on, uh, keep the cable on. Uh, help uh, pay their toll, gas, parking. A lot of families have to go into the city, and uh, parking in Manhattan is so expensive, and tough to, times are tough for these families financially. So Ocean of Love will step in and just help out these families in, in any way. The holidays are coming up. They provide dinners, Christmas presents, uh, Hanukkah presents, whatever these families need, Ocean of Love pretty much steps in and helps. I, I truly believe that... People that have never gone through this, Andy, now you know I am a survivor and I've gone through it, so I know exactly what they're going through. But people that have never had to deal with a child with cancer don't know. With an adult, it's completely different. It's com- it's a completely different way of treating and, and what happens with an adult. With a child, it's still something that's being taken care of by a mother and, and or a father or a mother and a father. Uh, nine times out of ten, they're siblings. So when yeah. that child gets sick, the whole family suffers. Even though the child is suffering with the disease, the rest of the family is also suffering. Yeah, a lot of times, you know, uh, a parent has to quit their job. Mm-hmm. And a lot of times with the siblings, because the parents are, are with their sick child at treatment in Philadelphia or Manhattan, a lot of times these kids have to come home from school and there's nobody home. And Ocean Blood will help the, the siblings out, making sure there's food in the refrigerator while the parents are at treatment. We're making sure the kids are being picked up from school. Another family member, another Ocean Love volunteer will step in and help out. So Ocean Love pretty much helps out these families, um, you know, in any way, any way possible. And, you know, and the kids who are sick, they have the smiles on their face, and the parents are the ones who are stressing out. The parents are the ones who are like, what do we do here? What do we do? And, and the kids handle it pretty well, but Ocean Love steps in, and they're there for the parents, that's for sure. All right, so what are you up to now? Well, it's a little slow. That's okay. uh, true. Um, we're a little behind from last year. We're, our, our final goal on Friday is $105,700. Right. We're at $15,000, 15200 to be exact. Okay. So you're behind fifteen. No, you're at 15000 Well, at 15000 We're probably down about 5000 where we were last year. Uh, so, but that all changes, you know. But it's a beautiful day out. It's going to be beautiful. There's no excuse. Excuse me. There's no excuse of why people can't come out and make that donation. They could come to the billboard site, the Target Low Shopping Center. They could go to our website at 1057thehawk.com, make a donation there as well. Okay. I hope to see you either today or tomorrow. I'm going to pop out because I always do. Um, You're going to come up? You're going to come up the billboard this year? If you want me to come up, I'll come up again. (laughs) <laughs> you did it a couple of years ago. You you conquered your fears of height. That was awesome. And, and with a thousand dollar donation from our listener friend D. That's right. Remember? That's right. Yeah. I do. 
So, you know, okay. maybe I'll stay on the ground this time. I'll bring Norman with me. He'll say hi okay. to you, all right, and then we'll just cheer you on. And, listen, friends, please, if you're driving by, you don't want to get out of the car, just drop a drop it in the bucket. Go by slowly. Yeah. Don't hit anybody. Drop the money no. in the bucket or stop by, say hello, see what's going on. And it's just a wonderful, wonderful thing that you're doing, Andy. And oh, yesterday I wrote a blog on this. And, um, oh, that's fantastic. yeah, Bradley's putting it up and exactly what you said, I put in that blog. And it was so funny because, you know, you've heard stories, you've listened to the children, you've listened to the families, and that's exactly what goes on. And that's why Ocean of Love is so important to this community. Yeah. Uh, you, you know, if I, if I can add one more thing, Marion, I'm yeah. sorry to interrupt you. Like, you know, one of the families said something to me a few weeks ago, and it really, really hit home is when these kids. Uh, when they're at the doctor's office or when they finally get those results about it's cancer and they find that find out that news, there's no handbook for this. And the reality is the parents and the child, a lot of times, they just get sent home. Mm-hmm. And not in a bad way. It's not like go home and deal with this. They go, they have to go home at some point And they're like, what do we do? There's no, like, if they say it's the weirdest thing. Is, okay, now they're sitting at home. They're in their kitchen, sitting on the couch. What do we do? And Ocean of Love knows what to do. And that's why they make that phone call. Ocean of Love immediately puts these families somewhat at ease, a little bit, just saying, hey, we're here for you. We'll help you. We know what to do. We'll, we'll figure this out together when they don't know what to do. So Ocean Love is there for that emotional support as well. Well, Andy, again, you're doing a great thing. Uh, Listener friends, Andy will be up there until Friday afternoon. Um, and I, I feel it. You're going to raise the money, and I hope you go well, way over. We've always we've always hit our goal. We've never we've never fell short, and I don't want to make this year the year that we don't hit our goal. So well, one hundred eighty five thousand seven hundred dollars. We thank everybody for their generosity, of course. And we thank you for what you're doing, Andy. And I'll see you either today or tomorrow. If you need anything, holler, and I'll bring it up to you. Andy, it's hey, a Jim, tell- it's a wonderful what? thing, a wonderful thing that you're doing, and 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 uh, I'm I'm sure this won't be the year that you don't want to happen. No, I think we'll do good, and and we're going to make it this year, Bob. And uh, come out here, too, man. I'd like to see your face also. It'd be great to see you out here if you can. Thank you very much for your continued support, of course. Anytime, Andy. And hopefully a lot of our listener friends will come out there and, and drop you a couple checks here and there. And every little bit helps. Every little every bit. Every little bit, yep. No amount is too small. It all That's adds up. Now. All right, Andy. Stay safe up there, and I'll talk to you later. All right, Bob Marion. Thank you very much. All right, honey. Bye. Bye. Bye-bye. Hi. It's a great thing. Yeah. It's a very good thing. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to go up again. I, I did the ladder once. I'm not going to do it again. I'll stay on so the So yesterday, yeah. Linda told us a story. There was a family out there uh-huh. that couldn't pay their mortgage. And if they didn't pay their mortgage, they were getting their house taken away. Oh, yeah. Linda made sure that they had that check out in the mail that day. Yep. To well, pay their any, mortgage. Any money that is given to them today will be in the bank by tonight. And going out the next day, when you have a child with cancer, um, the last thing that you need is to be stressed out because that's not helping the child at all. When the child is sick, they need your 100 percent attention and support. And if you know that you've got to go you know, take your child to Philly, to New York or whatever, um, that you now you're wondering, OK, well, I've got Johnny at home. I got little Mary at home. I got to feed them dinner. I got to feed them lunch. Um, I don't have money for the tolls, the gas alone. All those things don't come into play. You don't think about those things. But these are things that are reality with families with cancer, with children. And again, I said, no, there should be no childhood cancer. I don't, I don't understand it. No, I can't question God. I don't know. But childhood cancer is something that needs to be eradicated. But if it can't, we've got to be able to help the family to help the child get better. There's so many little things that go along with, oh my God, your child has cancer. You know, it's feeding the other ones. Like I said, it's a toll. It's the gas money. It's where do I find a doctor? Who do I go to? Where do I go to? Just little things like that. So, listener friends, please, if you can, Target Lowe's Shopping Center, 24 hours a day until Friday, okay? Stop out there. Drop off a couple dollars if you can. It's 818. We are Bob and Marianne in the morning, and we'll be right back.